Now here's an instrument you don't see a lot of in the lower price range because most of the time a cheap bass clarinet will sound really nasty. However, this is the JP122 Ebonite bass clarinet, currently only to low E flat, but a low C model, I believe, is in the pipeline from the laboratory in room 79163, just up the corridor, here in the development bunker, seven miles under John Packers of Taunton in Somerset. Now, what you want out of a good bass clarinet is a good strong noise. You also want the throat register notes and the notes over the break to come out nice and cleanly without any squeaking or any of that kind of treading on sort of eggshells kind of feeling you can get with a bass clarinet in this register. And this one, it just sings out pure and simple. Unusually for a bass clarinet of this kind, the register above that, which you don't often need, but it's kind of nice to fiddle around with, is also there nice and firm. So you've got a big old range on the hooter here. Uh, it's very effective, played with the subtone in the lower octave. And the price at which is it available means that it opens the doors for all these kinds of bass clarinet related activities for the school band, the training band, the wind band. People who play in an amateur athletic show might want to have their own instrument, now you can. And for anybody who plays in a big band, of course, I'm sure you'll recognize and enjoy, what I say enjoy, this. Where's Frank? <laughs>